capitalism ended racial segregation in this country. Now, obviously, racial segregation is still going on. However, I saw the movie 42 Today about Jackie Robinson, the first black player in the MLB. And there's something very interesting about that movie, about what happened. Capitalism... Let's look into baseball for a second. One of the human drives for what makes baseball so popular is obviously that team spirit, that competition, that drive to win. It's what makes us want to watch sports. But then there's the second element. When a sports team wins and is doing well, ticket sales go up, jersey sales go up, capitalism goes up. And during the 1940s, before Jackie Robinson, there was this untapped human resource of black baseball players that were not in the big leagues. So, obviously due to the racial discrimination. But the thing is, this capitalism, this this view for talent, for seeing this untapped human resource led to, this is one of the factors, led to civil rights movement, it kind of scaled down, and now we're in a much better place. We've still got a lot of work to do. But that's a brief word on how capitalism, baseball, led to improvement of racial conditions in this country.